Hi, my name is Cindy Needham and these are my YouTube instructions on how to use a proportional wheel. Uh, this is something that I've used for many years when I want to enlarge or reduce a design without having to make 20 copies in order to get the size that I want. It's very easy to use. Uh, you can easily find these in art and craft stores, office supply stores, Amazon and so forth and they'll run you about $6. Okay, the inside wheel, this little guy, this is the size of your original design. The outside wheel, this is the size that you want your design to be. And this little window right here is going to show you the percentage that you need to punch into your copy to enlarge or reduce. All right, so. My original design is 8 inches wide and I want to reduce it to 3.5 inches wide. So I go to my proportional wheel and I find 8 which is the size of my original and then I take that 8 and I turn it until it lines up with three and a half, which is right here. In my window, this little wiggly line points to 44. This is the percentage that I need to punch into the copier. So one more time. I lined up the eight on the inside wheel to the three and a half inch on the outside wheel. I reduced my image by 44% at my copier and voila, I got a perfect three and a half inch reduction with only one copy. So if you have any questions at all, you can email me at linenquilter at comcast.net or you can contact me off of my website which is cindyneedham.com. Thank you very much and let me know if you have any questions at all.